It's Monday, October 19, and if you've been dreaming of a world in which you didn't have to watch ads on YouTube, your dream comes true this Wednesday. Google's streaming video site launches its subscription-based tier in two days, and aside from providing hours upon hours of ad-free cat videos, the $10 a month fee will also net you exclusive access to new YouTube original content. The site recently nailed down deals for new original series from star YouTuber Smosh, Prank vs. Prank, Joey Graceffa, and The Fine Brothers, but if you want to see them, you'll be paying more than the price of a basic Netflix subscription to get it. YouTube has also been working deals with big-time content creators like NBC, A&E, and Fox Sports, so there could be even more to this subscription thing than just ad-free cats and epic fail videos. On a slightly more sensitive note, researchers at Stanford have developed a new type of artificial skin that has feelings. The transparent material integrates a pressure sensor that can register anything from a firm pinch all the way up to thousands of pounds of pressure. The tech has some big implications in the field of prosthetics, which would be a huge breakthrough on its own, but scientists are also talking about robotic applications. That's right, robots with feelings. Think about that for a second. And finally, say happy birthday to the Nintendo Entertainment System. Yes, 30 years ago today, Nintendo's twisted plan to take over Christmas began while kids everywhere had no idea their lives were about to change. The launch of the gaming system brought Mario into our homes, and before anyone knew it, we were all feverishly pounding up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right, A, B, start into our control pads so that we could finally beat Contra. Don't laugh, that was a hack back in the day. And video games haven't quite been the same since. As always, you can read more about these stories and all the rest of the day's tech news at digitaltrends.com. That's it for DT Daily today. We'll see you again tomorrow.